Hello and welcome to My Little Marcus Garage. Today I've got a short episode for you guys, uh, mostly sort of a how to, uh, not, not mostly, it's it, it just a how to. Uh, basically, I've uh, recently, and recently I mean today, changed the lift supports on my Ford Escort. And uh, since I've never owned a car before, I tried to Google how to do it correctly. Well, on YouTube I did not find a model specific video about changing these. And, well, since I managed to pull it off without any help, uh, I thought that, you know, this, although it's very easy, very simple and very quick, not, you know, it's Probably someone, somewhere, somewhere, <laughs> that's not even a word, but yeah, whatever, will, you know, wonder on, you know, how to how to do this. And I think it's, um, it's a good idea to show you guys how to do it. It's very simple, very quick. Uh, so basically, this is, ooh, nice catch. This is a trunk lift support, trunk luggage compartment, depending where you live. Let's just call it trunk, it's quicker. This is a trunk lift support from a 1989 Ford Escort Mark IV hatchback. The 1.4 liter ICL model. The, um, well, the way this works is it's very heavy. I can't even do it myself. But, uh, you know, it lifts and closes your trunk up and down uh, and basically, if you look closely at the, you know, at the ends of uh, the lift supports, they have like teeny tiny uh, notches in them and on the other side of that notch, or the hole with a notch, there is, there is a piece of metal with sort of a cutout for a screwdriver. So when you're taking this off, what you do is you take a screwdriver, uh, preferably one that you know fits that size of the notch, and you sort of just lift up the uh, the piece of metal that's sitting on the. And uh, while you're lifting it up, you should be able to pull it, pull the 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 thing out out of your car. If it doesn't want to, you know, go out, just pull it out completely. It's not like you're gonna need it afterwards. Uh, so you can you can pull it out completely. It will not destroy anything. It'll just you know pop out. You can you can pop it back in if you want, uh, and that will do the job as well. And at that point, you just you know take it off, and you have to do it both at the top and bottom of the lift support. Now, what you do is you grab your brand new lift support and uh, this this thing is very very simple you just pop it in that's it no no screwdrivers no nothing you just press it in pop it in it should make a pop like you know you know like a good pop then you could you know check if it's on there it shouldn't be able to go out since there is a piece of metal plate holding the um, the lift support on the truck and uh, that's it. Once you've installed it from the top and the bottom, you're finished. It's very simple, very quick, very easy, very cheap as well. Uh, you can buy these for uh, in Europe uh, for around 20 quid uh, for a pair. New, brand new. Uh, so they are very cheap, very affordable, and you definitely don't need to be a mechanic to do this sort of thing. All the tools you need is a screwdriver and perhaps a helping hand in case the, the old lift supports are so worn out that the trunk wouldn't keep itself open at all. Then it's you know, pretty smart to have another person holding the trunk while you're changing the lift supports because the trunk without lift supports is surprisingly heavy, which I didn't know before today. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I hope that you found this video relatively interesting. I hope it was quick and painless. Uh, maybe it did some good for you folks that are owning a 1989 Ford Escort Mark IV with hatchback. Uh, so yeah.
thanks for watching. Remember to leave a like, subscribe, perhaps comment, and as always, keep on riding.